people who have received both doses of a COVID-19 vaccine are half as likely to be infected with the coronavirus than those who have not been vaccinated, according to a new study led by researchers at Imperial College London, though the scientists warned a new vaccine targeting the infectious Delta variant may be needed to combat concerns over vaccine efficacy. 1 in 26. That's the chance of being infected with COVID-19 if you're in contact with an infected individual and fully vaccinated, the researchers found. This is compared to a 1 in 13 chance for the unvaccinated. Unvaccinated young people and the infectious Delta variant are driving the new wave of cases in the UK, the researchers said, a trend that is mirrored in the US high vaccination rates in the country have helped contribute towards a possible decoupling between infection, severe illness and death, which prompted the government to drop almost all social restrictions on July 19 amid some of the highest infection rates in the world. However, experts still warn of the risks of long COVID should the virus be allowed to spread unchecked. The sometimes debilitating long-term after-effects of an infection do not appear to be linked to how severe the initial infection was, though recent evidence indicates they may be less likely in children. The findings from this study suggest lower viral loads in the fully vaccinated people who are infected, which correspond with lower chances of passing the virus on to others. The CDC recently found signs vaccinated people may be just as infectious as the unvaccinated, however, and further research will be needed to settle the matter. A lower chance does not mean zero chance, and the CDC recommends even the fully vaccinated to wear masks in certain places. Despite tangible evidence that unvaccinated people are driving new waves of COVID-19 in highly vaccinated countries, which has a far-reaching impact beyond individual health, most unvaccinated Americans feel little responsibility for its spread, a recent poll indicates. Opposition to vaccination has hardly shifted in months and some employers have started to require vaccines for their employees to boost flagging numbers. Most unvaccinated Americans don't feel responsible for surging COVID cases, poll suggests. Here's who they blame, Forbes, Pfizer shot just 39% effective against Delta infection, but largely prevents severe illness, Israel study suggests, Forbes, Johnson & Johnson vaccine far less effective against Delta variant, study suggests, Forbes, React 1 round 13 final report, exponential growth, high prevalence of SARS-CoV-2 and vaccine effectiveness associated with Delta variant in England during May to July full coverage and live updates on the coronavirus.